Hello YouTube. This is just going to be a short sort of a video here. Um, something that pertains to the stuff I've been talking about a good bit lately is, you know, stepping back and kind of detoxing and relaxing, mental inventory and stuff like that. Something that I've been learning and have needed to drill into my very stubborn head. <laughs> I'm human too, and I'm a stubborn human, is that, well, the baseline here is that it's okay to take a step back from things. It doesn't make you a bad person or a bad magician or whatever else. To need a break doesn't make you bad or anything. And even for us darker witches and left-hand path followers, we still need a break sometimes and spirits contrary to popular belief demons are not like all really hard in your face like they're not all drill sergeants all the time they can be some of them definitely can be and some of them are more than others some are more sympathetic than others that's definitely the truth but I don't want you to be afraid to take a step back and to be able to talk to that spirit that you have a relationship with, that you're working with, if you need to take a step back or if you're not feeling up to a ritual that you had planned or something like that. In my experience, they've been very understanding with that sort of thing and with rescheduling and such. And just, you know, rehashing, rethinking about things and taking a step back with you so you don't have to suffer through it. So then you're not, like, bleeding, seeking gain, gains and stuff. So, speak up. Don't be afraid to speak up. Because if you have a relationship, a solid relationship with the spirit, even if you have a pact with them or something... And you feel drained or you feel like you need to take a step back don't be afraid to say that to them work something out I mean a relationship is a relationship it's not like a one-sided thing where it's like you know your part they know their part and then we do their our parts separately no this this involves coming back to each other and talking to each other and understanding that you can and you can talk to them and you know, I would assume, you know, if you have all, all your ducks in a row and everything's happy between you two and it's a real reason and everything and not just laziness or something, that they're going to be understanding and you can work something out, make, make yourself a deal of rescheduling or a rain check or whatever you need, but make sure you follow up too, but don't be afraid to speak up. They're not going to hurt you as long as you're up front, as far as my experience goes. Like, they shouldn't get upset with you. I mean, there are petty spirits there, but the higher level beings that I've dealt with, they haven't been petty with me. They've been very understanding of conditions and the humanity that surrounds me, because I'm human and life happens. And that has been a blessing in itself. And for anyone who is a beginner or who is stubborn and feeling down or just stubborn, I felt like I should say this. And I felt like I was being pushed to say this as well. Because, you know, I want to learn and then share what I learn. So remember this. Don't be afraid. Speak up. Hey, Lucifer. I thank him for showing me this more and more every time we work together and things and things come up. But thank you. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. And have a lovely day, evening, whatever is coming up for you.